How did Big Sean go from battle rapper to marketing expert? Big Sean had the vision to build his brand into an empire rooted in his hometown loyalty. He turned passion into profit by choosing partnerships that expanded his reach while staying grounded to Detroit. Now, Big Sean is a marketing trailblazer who made historic moves in music, fashion, sports, and more. Sean first made waves in hip hop with his own distinctive style and sound. His flashy sneakers and hats rocked to the side became signature pieces of his brand image. Early on, Big Sean Sean created unique looks so fans could align themselves with his Detroit cool vibe. Whether it was his breakout deal with Adidas or his historic partnership with Puma, Big Sean strategically aligned his personal style with a brand that advanced his visions. His clothing collabs allowed Sean to rep his city at scale. While his sound evolved over the years, Sean's sense of hometown pride and signature fashion aesthetic never wavered. Big Sean laid the groundwork for a lasting empire by knowing exactly who he was as an artist. His brand identity flowed effortlessly from his life growing up in Detroit. He perfected the blueprint for turning passion into profit again without selling out, some may say. Before he was rocking out soul shows from arenas worldwide, Sean was just a creative kid from inner city Detroit trying to make it in hip hop. Sean Michael Leonard Anderson was born in 1988 in Santa Monica, California. But Sean considers Motor City his one true home. When he was only three months old, his mother Mother Myra brought Sean back to Detroit where he belonged. Myra raised Sean alongside his grandmother, Mildred Lennon, an inspirational woman who was one of the first black female captains in the army. Sean attended Detroit Waldorf School, a unique place focused on developing each child's individual gifts. Through poetry, singing, and performance art, Sean discovered rap as his passion by sixth grade. Even in middle school, Sean displaced lyrical talents and wordplay far beyond his years. His eighth grade classmates voted Sean most likely to actually be a rapper from Detroit, an old man of success yet to come. By high school, at Cos Technical, Sean hustled non-stop to get his music heard around Detroit. He battled other hungry MCs on local radio stations, WHTD each week, proving his skills against the best competition Detroit had to offer. Sean sold his own mixtapes, slowly building a fan base and reputation in the city that he was from. One day in 2005, Sean got word his idol Kanye West was visiting the 102.7 FM radio station. So Sean camped outside the studio, refusing to leave until Kanye gave him a chance. Though Kanye was in a rush, Sean begged him for just 16 bars to prove his skill. Kanye reluctantly agreed, but Sean proceeded to split hot fire nonstop for nearly 10 minutes straight. Kanye was completely blown away by Sean's raw talent and endless bars. He told Sean, I don't know if you're ready yet, but work on some things and we gonna link back up in the future. Short enough, just two years later in 2007, Kanye signed the hungry 21-year-old Big Sean to his highly selective record label, Good Music. Getting Kanye COVID stamp of approval propelled Sean's rise to stardom. Sean credits Kanye along with Biggie, Eminem, and J. Dilla as his biggest hip-hop influences. But under Kanye's mentorship, Sean honed his own signature style unapologetically Detroit. As a new artist, embraced the opportunities allowed him to be inside of creative freedom. He posed for billionaires boys club campaigns and became a regular face of Tisa clothing. To Sean, fashion intertwined seamlessly with music as forms of artistic self-expression. His big breakout deal came in 2013 with Adidas. As a nod to his hometown, Sean designed a special Detroit Place edition sneaker. The chance to rep Detroit culture on a global scale was a dream come true. That same year, Sean also launched his own clothing line called Oral go. Dabbing in fashion showed Sean's willingness to explore creative lanes beyond just music. After five very successful years partnered with Adidas, he made the daring move to sign with a competitor, Puma, in 2017. The shocking switch left some fans scratching their heads, but Sean trusted his instincts to keep evolving as an artist into new territory. To announce the game-changing Puma partnership, Sean released the edgy music video for his new single, Move. Decked out head toe to toe in Puma's burgundy velour track pants and black suede sneakers, Sean's flashy visuals matched the song's bold new sound. The strong reaction proved he could take risks without losing the supporters who had been down since day one. In the catchy chorus, Sean flexes about his fancy new footwear deal. While Sean's brand grew on a global scale, he never turned his back on the city that birthed him. Giving back and uplifting Detroit has remained central to his mission. In 2012, Sean launches 
nonprofit called the Sean Anderson's Foundation. Its mission is improving the lives of underserved youth right in his hometown. Fast forward 11 years later, it's still going strong. The foundation has funded art programs, donated to recording studios, to schools, and organized the Don Weekend Festival to unite residents throughout music and culture. When the Detroit Pistons recruited Sean as creative director in 2020, he jumped at the chance to rep his city. Sean redesigned the team's practice jerseys and uniforms with his Don Life logo front and center, a constant reminder of his Detroit roots. He didn't stop there. Sean also partnered with McDonald's on scholarships for Detroit students through their Black and Positively Golden Mentorship Program. There's a pattern here with Sean. Regardless of his own fame and success, Sean stays determined to lift up future generations from the city that made him who he is. Sean offers a blueprint for greatness through hard work and repping to be proud of where you come from. Want to make your own mark someday? Take these practical tips from Big Sean's proven brand strategy. You gotta be yourself, y'all. I always say this in almost every single one of my videos, but I mean, staying true to who you are is probably one of the easiest things that can work out while trying to alter one's perception inside of their head. Even as Big Sean taught the world, he never abandoned Detroit. He still invests in his community and embraces his hometown and his music and business ventures. Don't forget where you ever come from. Sean could have sold out for quick fame and big checks but he forged his own path in hip hop on his own terms. Everything he do doesn't feel forced, creating the right perception in his fans head. View your art and brand as an extension of your identity, all right? When people think about you in terms of your personal brand, it should trigger some type of emotion that they should have set out for you. And that emotion is gonna come from exactly what you do and the service that you actually serve out there inside this digital world. Leverage your platforms to lift others up through his foundation and partnerships. Capitalize off opportunities that come your way. Sean turned a chance meeting with Kanye into a life-changing record deal. Seize every opportunity even when you doubt yourself. Surround yourself with a strong and loyal support system. Big Sean's team, from his family to friends to his manager, keep him grounded. So you have to build your network intentionally and always hustle harder than the competition. Big Sean outworked every other rapper in Detroit to get noticed. You create your own luck through non-stop grinding and constantly trying to improve yourself day by day. Over a decade into his rap career, Big Sean has achieved the rare feature of maintaining relevance at the top of the charts. He matured his image without compromising authenticity. He's taking bold risks like that out of the left field partnership with Puma that paid off in the end. Everything comes full circle back to Sean's Detroit upbringings to his day once. At its core, Big Sean personal branding teaches us the power of loyalty and hustle. By remembering his hometown, Sean always maintained the right moves to mature his brand. He nurtured a loyal community by keeping it real heavy each and every step of the way. Sean offers hope that you can achieve your wildest dreams without abandoning your roots. Keep your brand identity rooted in your genuine values and passions, all right? Stay true to who you are, dream big, Work hard, that's the Don Life way. If you enjoyed this deep dive into Big Sean's brand and brilliance, give it a like and share it with your friends. Leave a comment letting me know what other innovative artists, marketing strategies you want us to explore next. Thanks for watching, y'all. Stay tuned for more. I hope you guys have a beautiful, blessed week, and I hope you guys manifest what you so desperately desire. All right, y'all? Don't forget to subscribe to my channel too. We're working hard out here. Till next time, I'm out.